You remember how we're raising money for the church parking lot fund? Yeah. Well, I mean, we're so close. We're almost there. Yeah, we've raised what, $60,000? Yeah, we've raised over $60,000, Robert Ergang. I'm trying to think of how we can get over the top. We're almost there. We need something to take us to the next level. And I've tried a few different things. Yeah, how are those working out for you? They've not worked out very well. What kind of things? Uh, first, I tried picking up shifts at Jay's place. Ow! Ah! Ah! How do you get fired from Jay's place? And almost lose an arm, foot, and leg in the process. <laughs> Did you try anything else? Well, I tried making a GoFundMe page. I'm the pastor, I promise. And after I got out of jail, everything was okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> and I'm not proud of this. And if you tell Bob or Tammy, I'll fire you. But I even tried dancing out front, in front of the church for money. Oof. I'm the pastor, I promise. I'm the pastor. No, no, no. Whoa. I know, I know. Nothing has worked out the way that I thought it would, but I have finally devised a foolproof plan. Now, you know how I've always been talking about how I'm saying I'm too fat, I need to lose weight, I need to lose weight. Well, I do, but I have finally come up with the perfect solution to help me lose weight in 2018 and raise money for the church parking lot fund at the same time. How are you gonna do that? That's a good question. I'm glad that you asked. Yeah, okay, first off, I really wanna lose weight because there's so many things in my life that'd be a lot easier. For example, I would really like to be able to fit in my suit jackets again. Real snow. Another reason I want to lose weight is I'd like to be able to get in my baptismal waders without the assistance of somebody else. Number three, I want to be able to run more than 100 feet without barfing like a beach whale. <laughs> But I finally got it. Here's my foolproof plan. I'm calling it Operation Get Arm Fat Copple Fat Stat. Operation Get Arms Fast Cat? No, 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 no. Operation, say it with me, get arm fat, copple fat stat. Get arms, there's fat stats? No, Robbie. Operation, get arm fat, copple fat stat. I don't get it. Let me spell it out for you, Robert Benjamin. Operation, get the pastor healthy and raise money for the church parking lot fund at the same time. Operation, get arm fat, copple fat stat. Whoa. I am on a mission to lose weight and I'm asking the congregation to donate a certain dollar amount, $3 or $6 for every pound I lose from now until April the 1st, 90 days. And I gotta have your help, Robbie. I need you to help me implement Operation Gatharm Fat Copple Fat Stat so that you can turn me from this into this. I need you, Robbie, to be the Mickey to my Rocky. Wait. Didn't Mickey die? 
I need you to be my Apollo to my Rocky. But didn't Apollo die too? Huh. I need you to be my Don King to my Tyson. But I digress. Let's just go to the plan of action. Number one, no pop, no Pepsi, no Coke, no caffeinated beverages whatsoever, no carbonated drinks. Number two, no sweets, no cakes, pies, donuts, anything delicious, no sweets whatsoever. Wait, not even Miss Tinny's chocolate meringue pie? Even Miss Tinny's chocolate meringue pie. What, what about Miss Francis's sugar-free desserts? Even Miss Francis's sugar-free desserts. I love those ladies, no sweets. Man, is this a little overboard? No, I'm serious. No, I didn't write this. Where did this come from? This is not part of the plan. We hope you enjoyed watching this video. It was a lot of fun to put together. And as you've seen, my goal for the next 90 days is to lose weight and also raise money for the parking lot fund. You see, 20 some years ago, Jesus Christ saved my soul and he transformed me. And there's been a spiritual transformation that has taken place. But unfortunately, my own personal disobedience has impeded the physical transformation. And so it's our goal and my goal, not only to lose weight, but also to do it for a noble cause. And in this case, to raise money for our church parking lot fund. So inside your bulletins today, there was a pledge card. And what I wanna ask you to do is this. Would you prayerfully consider partnering alongside me and for every pound in the next 90 days that I lose, pledge to donate a certain dollar amount. Now I'm not asking you to do anything that I'm not willing to commit to myself. And so my wife and I are personally pledging $10 per pound that I lose to go to the parking lot fund. You see, I want to have a physical transformation in my life, but I want to do it for a noble cause. And so I pray that you will consider partnering alongside with us the next 90 days and pledging a certain dollar amount for every pound that I lose. And at the end of the 90 day period, it's going to be April the 1st and that's Easter. On Easter Sunday, we'll unveil just how much weight I've lost and see how much money we can give to the glory of God to meet this goal and our parking lot fund. Edgewood Baptist Church, it is an honor to be your pastor and I love you more than you'll ever know. My request is that you would prayerfully consider coming alongside and praying about a specific dollar amount to donate to the parking lot fund for every pound I lose the next 90 days in 2018.